Welcome to another Tuesday Happy Home Paradise live stream, the final Tuesday Happy Home Paradise live stream because today we're going to be speed running this DLC. We're going to finish it once and for all because I don't know if I can keep playing this every single week. I'm getting kind of bored. <laughs> okay, listen, I'm just not the best and I don't find much enjoyment in interior design in Animal Crossing New Horizons. So. I just want to get this done so that I can decorate and change up the villager houses on my island and not have to worry about it. No offense to Nico and Lottie and Wardell, they're really cute and yeah, but I just, we need, we need to finish this once and for all. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to speed run Happy Home Paradise. I don't, I'm not even going to try decorating the inside or anything, like I think I'm just going to open up their boxes and say all right here's your vacation home now deal with it but welcome in everyone happy tuesday i hope you're having a great week hello kim hello sammy hi corbs vinyl and cassettes super cool uh welcome in welcome to your first stream hi jake how's it going hello pumpkin and ava and michelle and cozy stars how's it going hello ash you can just put the required items in their house and be done exactly. Like, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna throw them into random lots. I don't even know who this is, Gonzo? I don't- I didn't even read what he wanted. Cause I don't care. <laughs> because I- I don't care. Oh, look, my cats are all hanging out. They're- they're hiding back here. I'm doing good, Ava. Thanks for asking. How are you doing today? I just got off work and I've been drinking this strawberry vanilla Olipop and it's so tasty so it makes me in a good mood. It makes me in a good mood to have a nice beverage. I'm like a beverage girl, I don't know about you guys, but um, yeah, I'm just, I always have a beverage. I don't know, what does he want in his home? Some sort of outdoor grilling space. This is gonna have to do. And then we'll just take a picture. I think, do we have to take a photo? I'm not sure. So is this all we have to do? Uh, we'll get this done in no time. We'll get this done in no time. We're gonna have to watch all of the sad montages where it's like... It's just gonna be the sad montage of their empty house with no decor. <laughs> a campground for glamping? That's what he wanted. That's actually kind of cute. Oh, okay, you don't have to take a photo. <laughs> oh, you can keep pressing B to skip? Thank you. Michelle with the tips and tricks. <laughs> that was kind of sad to watch. Like, I'm so sorry. Yeah, super aesthetic. Great. Uh, I should go now. Uh, yeah. I like how they're just praising me, saying that I put so much work and effort into the vacation home. And I'm about to get paid for this? Like, I'm a fraud. Oh no. <laughs> Not me just like pocketing $9,000 for doing absolutely nothing. I'm literally a fraud. Oh, an amiibo scanner. I didn't even know you could do that. 
Invisalign. I've like heard of Invisalign, but I don't really even know like what it is. Is it like the um, kind of like a, re a retainer, but it works as braces or something? I had braces when I was younger, which was quite the experience. Fauna! Oh my gosh! Yes, we have to do Fauna's house. I mean, I'm not. I I feel bad to to give her something ugly. She is my favorite. A piano hangout? Of course that's what she would want. She's so elegant. She's so elegant. <laughs> she is an angel. I'll, I'll put her over the cherry blossoms at least. So at least she'll have a good view in her empty, <laughs> her empty house. Oh my gosh. Wait, there was a there was a villager back there playing with the beach ball. I don't know if you guys saw that. That was so cute. <laughs> Hello, bread fan. Hello, star gamer. It's great to see you guys. How's it going? Oh my gosh, stop! Why does she look so cute with the cherry blossoms? Fauna, I'm so sorry that I'm going to do this to you. I regret my actions. <laughs> She looks so happy and like excited for her beautiful piano house and it's just it's not even gonna Oh We unlocked the partition walls Interesting, I don't think I ever made it this far in the past Oh, I can always redo their houses later that is true That is true Invisalign's like invisible braces and a retainer. That makes sense. That makes sense. I've like seen the ads for it. All right, Fauna. I'm so sorry. Hey, maybe maybe this is actually nice for her piano room because it's not like super overwhelming or crowded, and she can she can focus <laughs> on her music skills. Oh, not the montage. It's gonna be <laughs> so sad. <laughs> I have to take a screenshot. We're just- we're gonna skim. We're really speedrunning it. Ooh, Mario Galaxy 2? That sounds fun. I've never really played much of the Mario games. Like, I played, like, Super Mario Bros. But... Yeah. See, okay, I, here's the thing. I want to try all these, like, Switch games, like... Princess Peach Showtime. I really wanted to play Mario Wonder and just all of them, but they're like $60. That's so expensive. Like I can go get, there's so many free to play games and so many cheaper games that it's so hard for me to pay the $59.99 <laughs> for those Nintendo titles. They're just so expensive. For Animal Crossing, I'll do it though. <laughs> You should play Happy Home Paradise. I know I'm just like rushing through it. It is pretty fun, but I feel like it gets really repetitive. Um, I just like smacked my desk. But yeah, I feel like it gets really repetitive, especially playing it like every week. I just want to design my freaking villager homes back on my island. I want to customize them and make them really cute and screen core vibes. Okay, who's next? This is the one who likes the toilets. Oh, I hate the robot villagers. I mean, I don't even know why I'm trying to pick cute ones because I'm not even gonna decorate them. Pecan? She's so cute. Why have I like never paid attention to her? Yeah, sometimes it's, you just gotta speed through it. <laughs> you love the robot villagers? I don't know, the robot villagers bother me. Also, this villager has been in the background every single time, just like living her best life on the beach, and I aspire to be like her. I want to go to the beach so bad. Like, I've been craving... We were just talking about this on the last stream. I've been craving, like, warm, sunshine, like, beach vibes, and maybe, I, uh, maybe I'll bother my husband and tell him to take me to the beach soon. <laughs> um, husband, if you're watching this, take me to the beach, please. <laughs> <laughs> One of these weekends, please. Yeah, it's Cleo. I, Michelle, I feel like you tell me that villager's name every stream and I always forget. Yeah, I love the deer villagers too, Ava. 
<laughs> Hello B, welcome in. Oh yeah, thanks for the reminder to stay hydrated. Michelle, you're always coming in clutch with the Animal Crossing like tips, tricks, and information. You're keeping me in check. I also love Pietro too. I feel like Pietro is a hit or miss for some people. Some people are like terrified of clowns, which is completely valid, so they don't like Pietro. But I love him. <laughs> Thanks, Michelle. I didn't even read what she wanted. I think she wanted something chic. Here, I'll put some more effort into this one. I'll push the shrub or plant this tree thing over a little bit. There you go. I actually put an effort. <laughs> oh, you like the octopus villagers bread fan? I like, I don't know. The octopus villagers? I think I've been traumatized because I've seen them so much on villager hunts that I'm just like, I can't handle them anymore. A chic and relaxing home is literally so bad. It's so, it's okay, but it's, <laughs> it's kind of funny to watch the... <laughs> <laughs> the um what's it called the montage <laughs> i moved your bush ma'am good enough exactly hi mia hi jasmine welcome to this chaos <laughs> oh at least she likes it see these villagers they don't need much they're not high maintenance yeah especially zucker especially zucker i feel like i see him all the time uh, I should get going. Bye, Pecan. Hi, Jessica. Welcome in. Oh, you had Pecan on your island. <laughs> she gave you a cardboard box. <laughs> okay, but villager gifts are so funny. Oh, I'm just like collecting these paychecks for the absolute minimal work. I feel like I'm scamming Lottie and I feel so bad. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Lottie. I'm a fraud employee. You should probably fire me, but you're just too wholesome to even know what's going on. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Victim number four or number three? I don't know. Who else is here? Who else is here? I kind of want to do, I guess we'll do this little alligator who's wearing a leopard print top. Let's chat. Let's chat. Hello, welcome in. Oh my gosh, Star Gamer. Honestly, the expert terraforming, it took way too much brain power. A mushroom forest, that actually sounds really cute. Look, Cleo's still back there having just the best time on the beach. It just it's happening every time. She's living her life. Like she's even got people joining her now, like Fauna and Gonzo back there. <laughs> it's so cute. It is so cute. Valencia, welcome in. How's it going? Happy Tuesday. Happy, happy Tuesday. Honestly, this week's already going by so fast. I mean, like... I mean, it's, I guess it's only Tuesday, but I feel like it's going by faster than usual. I'm just ready for Friday now. <laughs> Neon leopard print is so 80s. I've never done anything that advanced and it's everything. It took everything out of me, my first attempt. Yeah. Terraforming is, like, kind of exhausting. Especially when I was doing the... Um, elegant core build like I wanted to maintain symmetry and so I would like do something and then I'm like oh man I'm gonna have to go repeat this entire thing again and that was so hard <laughs> okay Ali it's ready sorry it's not the cutest mushroom forest that you've ever seen um here you go <laughs> I'm doing good Valencia thank you I don't know how many houses I've done, Mia. I think that this is like the ninth or 10th one. I will have to check. Oh, this is so sad. <laughs> She's like, hmm, like I'm trying to pretend to be happy. This is like those home makeover shows where they like are doing the reveal of their house, but the person's like obviously not vibing with it and they don't like it, <laughs> but they're trying to be nice and they're on TV. <laughs> 
Yeah, I think we need 30 houses to to get the feature to decorate, to customize the houses back on our island. I think. I don't know. And like, does that mean that we beat the entire DLC when that happens? Oh, what's happening? I've been getting lots of calls from happy clients. Anyways, time to reap the rewards. <laughs> Here's your scam money. <laughs> By the way, did you know that- wait, what does this say? I can't even see with my face here. Did your last project- oh, my last project was a bit of a milestone. That's right, it was the 10th vacation home. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, we're having a party? Like a pizza party? <laughs> a pizza party? Oh my- it is a pizza party! It is a pizza party! Classic work pizza party. This is actually really cute. This is actually cute. <laughs> More doll is so adorable. Yeah, we have our juice. Lottie has like the span the fancy I just said spancy. She has the spancy drink. <laughs> oh, this is cute. Oh, how do I take a screenshot? I forgot. <laughs> Not me pressing the wrong buttons. We're having a pizza party. Aww. I love that. I, honestly, pizza sounds so good right now. By the way, what's everybody's favorite pizza toppings? Mine is pineapple. Okay, there's... This is too sentimental. This is too sentimental. <laughs> oh wow. I feel like they're like just celebrating my... Oh, we, oh wow, we're having another cheers. This is cute. Veggies, pepperoni, sausage, yum. Honestly, I would eat all of that. Lottie's just... Oh, they're all just plopped on the, on the ground. That's so cute. Um... Aww, we can't drink it though. It only does this. That's so cute. Um, I guess goodbye. <laughs> uh, see you later. <laughs> the party's over. <laughs> okay, let me work. I'm ready to work more. Okay, so we're one third of the way there, I think. I think. Oh, I've never tried mushroom on pizza before, but I would be willing to try it. Who is this? Cube? Let's do it. Let's do it. I've never, like, I don't think I've ever tried mushrooms. Actually, I have because I tried these vegan um, mushroom, like, it was like a beef jerky, but it was made out of mushrooms. But that, I think that's the only time I've ever tried mushroom. It was pretty good. Pinguino. <laughs> Cube is so cute. His eyes are a little creepy, but... They're cute at the same time. I will have to give it a try. <laughs> Husband, if you're watching, I want pizza. <laughs> I want pizza and I want to go to the beach. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Eco friendly factory. That's kind of a cute little idea. <laughs> my husband better be watching if he's watching any stream it better be this one because i'm making all of the requests well, this doesn't look too eco-friendly cube but we'll make it work brain freeze that's such a cute catchphrase pizza for breakfast kind of goes hard though it's been a long time since i had pizza for breakfast <laughs> 
This does not look eco-friendly. <laughs> You'll take notes for him. Thanks, Michelle. <laughs> this one's this one's interesting. <laughs> this one looks really cursed. <laughs> this one looks horrible. This does not look like good working conditions for our villagers. I'm sorry, Cube, to put you in this position. What do you want to do now? You want to hang out, Cube? I, I'm trying to speedrun this DLC, so I gotta go, buddy. What a wholesome villager, though. <laughs> I actually really liked him. Now let's collect our scam payment. I am speedrunning through this, Mia. I just want to unlock the perks. <gasps> we got a promotion, too. <laughs> See, work smarter, not not work harder, okay? Oh, but we got new work clothes. I don't, I don't, I'm not gonna change them. I'm not gonna change them. I'm pretty happy with our little work outfit. I think it's cute. Oh, I'll see you later, Jessica. Thanks for hanging out with us today. I appreciate it. <laughs> Okay, who's our next victim? Octavian? We were just talking about the octopus villagers. Okay, I'm not gonna lie though, he looks really weird sitting down. Also, the deep, like, cranky villager voices like this are so satisfying to me for some reason. A window to the sea. Okay. And Cleo's still back there. Cleo is still back there. <laughs> still enjoying the beach life and making me jealous. Thank you, Star Gamer. Thank you so much. The stream is honestly the highlight of my day. And I have been like reading the heck out of my book. This It's the first book in the Bridgerton series. Today, I made some progress in this book. Like I was getting into it. And also yesterday I started the anime series Attack on Titan, which that I watched so many episodes yesterday and I already know I'm about to watch some after the stream. All right, Octavian, let's give you your dream, <laughs> your very sad dream vacation home. This is like literally a fraudulent business. <laughs> okay, here we go. Here we go. Beautiful. This one might be the saddest one yet. It's it's so empty. It's just a floaty and, and a little towel. <laughs> oh no. What does Nico need? Okay. I can't read what he's saying. You can make different effects. Oh, this is just about the, um, what's it called? I don't even know what it's called when you, when you put, I don't know, it's like you put wax on the furniture or something and it sparkles. <laughs> this is so sad. Look at this. Oh, he is the one who, he really is calling me out. Look, done already, but you hardly even started. Oh, reckon that's why they call you the pro. <laughs> <laughs> yes, polishing. <laughs> yes. Yeah, Attack on Titan is really good so far. It's like it's like kind of intense and a little sad, but I'm screenshotting all these just because they're so funny. <laughs> I mean, at least he's enjoying it, I guess. He's he's really taking it in. Like, he's not the one who literally picked out this furniture. He's acting like I put it there. He literally picked it out himself. He's paying me to do- He's literally paying me when he's the one working. <laughs> Welcome back, Jake. Yeah, this is Octavian's really sad <laughs> vacation house. <laughs> and we're about to get paid 12,000 pokey for that. <laughs> oh, 
I'll have a new video out on Friday. Oh. So do we have to do... We have to do a facility? I did the cafe last time, so I guess I'll do the restaurant. Um, but I'm still just gonna... I'm still just gonna put the required furniture and then go. True, Kina, true. Okay, I'll at least make the outside cute. I kind of like the pink. But I also kind of like the blue. We're gonna go with this. We're gonna go with this. <laughs> we'll make the outside look cute, but the inside? We'll see. Oh. There's two rooms in here. Fancy. Design a restaurant. Alright, what are the requirements? A cash register. Let's throw one of these. A table and four chairs. Okay. Let me just go stand over here then. There we go. Beautiful. <laughs> Beautiful. 10 out of 10 design skills. This is the cutest restaurant I've ever seen in Happy Home Paradise. Hands down. And what do we need in here? Just anything? There we go. I'm finished. Oh, we get to decide who's working though? Wait, which one is this? Oh, the chef? Okay. Who should be the chef? <laughs> Mo? Mo's the teacher. I feel like Octavian would be a good chef. Like, he has that fiery Gordon Ramsay energy. His apprentice totally has to be cube. I I appreciate that. Fauna would be amazing at customer service. And Pecan? Yeah, I mean, I guess, I guess Pecan can be the employee. I <laughs> love the creativity, thanks. It just, it took all my brain power to, to put this together. Um, yeah, we'll name this later. We'll name this later. For now, let's just call it restaurant. Let's just call it restaurant, okay? Oh, this is so sad. <laughs> the, <laughs> the cash register is literally on the floor. Poor Fauna, she's just like, I guess I'll work here. <laughs> Pecan's like, oh no. This <laughs> Wait, you know what this reminds me of? This reminds me of the... Willy Wonka like scam experience that, that went super viral a couple of weeks ago. <laughs> That's what this reminds me of. Oh yeah. <laughs> this is cute. <laughs> Love it. Love it. The facility is done. Okay, I'll take a photo. There we go. Just zoom in. Yeah, the fake Willy Wonka event. Um, wait, I oh we have to take the celebratory photo outside. Gotcha, gotcha. That makes sense. Let's do it then. No, because that like photo of the employee at the Willy Wonka event where. They're just like standing there with smoke around them and like chemistry equipment. It's just so funny. Oh, this is cute. I always like the moments like this where it's just super cute and all the villagers are together. Okay. Cute. Cute, it's perfect. Of course, Fauna is standing next to me because we're besties. <laughs> Aww. I feel bad. I feel bad that that the, the restaurant's not very nice on the inside. 
<laughs> but it's okay. All right. There's so much dialogue in this game. Ooh, 25,000 Pokey. I'm interested to see how much Pokey we have at the end of this because I don't think that I've ever... Okay, wait. I think I spent Pokey twice at the very beginning. I bought some chocolate and then I think I bought one item. Oh, my Lottie, please. You gotta chill with all this talking. But yeah, I haven't really spent any of the um, pokey that I've made, so I'm interested to see how much exactly we have by the end of all of this. It better be a lot. <laughs> okay, who's our next victim? I guess we'll do the toilet guy. Let's do it. I love that this villager has just become like the toilet villager. Cleo's not on the beach this time. How sad. The beach party has ended. All right, let's put him on, let's put him on this like glacier. <laughs> I think that would be kind of funny <laughs> to have a bathroom refuge in the middle of a glacier. Let's go. Let's do it. This is kind of cool. I have actually never seen this. I wish that we could like have stuff like this on our own island. Like we could change the landscape on this level. It's pretty cool. All right, let's give you the restroom of your dreams. Just a basic bathroom in the middle of an ice there we go there we go this is sad it's ready <laughs> let's go he looks happy i mean what what do you need like what more can you ask for with a restroom i mean maybe we could have added like a plant but we're in the middle of a glacier, so... <laughs> the snow on the windows. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> it's just so funny how they look so... Oh. Love that the toilet just opened by itself. But I love how enthusiastic they are. Um, I'm I'm leaving now. See you later. I don't even remember your name. <laughs> that sounds so mean. I'm sorry. Thank you, Lottie. Lionel. <laughs> See, Michelle, you're just always coming in clutch with, with the villager names. <laughs> okay. Okay. I don't even know what's happening. Oh, we can- there's a Happy Home Network app? I totally forgot about that. I totally forgot about that. Can you, like, see... How does that work? How does this work? Oh, we can, like, post it? Oh, these would be- these would be so sad. I just- and I totally forgot to even take a photo of this one. That's so sad. Look at this. They started out so strong and then you can just see the decline. <laughs> it's so sad. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. Alright, next victim. Who's it gonna be? 
Let's pick this little mouse. Bree? Why have I never heard of this villager? She's cute. Okay, I feel like the mouse villagers are so underrated, but also I feel like Nintendo did them a little dirty. Like, I feel like the shape and design of them is cute, but then they give them, like, just the worst color schemes. I feel like they could have made some really cute mice villagers. They missed out. Maybe I just haven't looked at all the mice villagers in a long time. Like, maybe there are, like, really cute ones and I'm just forgetting. I mean, I really like Broccolo. I really like Broccolo, but he's not... I don't like him because I think he's super cute. I'm gonna look up the mouse villagers because I'm curious now. Oh yeah, no. They could have done so much better. Yeah, Petrie is probably the best one. Alright, a toy box. Interesting choice of a vacation home. Interesting choice. There we go. Ooh, that's... Uh, this... This is creepy. That's also kind of creepy. I forgot about these items. I feel like I've never even seen that doll item. It's kind of weird. I'm gonna have this, like, music stuck in my head for the rest of the night. I can already tell. There we go. I'm skipping through that. <laughs> that emoji cracks me up every time. It never fails. Just like the standing emoji. It's so funny. That's exactly what the doll looks like. Hello, Nat. Welcome in. How's it going? Thanks for joining the Happy Home Paradise Chaos. Ava, I feel like everybody's scared of rats. I mean, at least in certain contexts. Like, if I saw a rat... And it was somebody's pet rat i wouldn't be scared but if i saw a rat just like out in the open i would probably be scared i've heard that rats are like way bigger than you anticipate i don't think i've ever just seen a loose rat up close so i wouldn't know but i have a friend who lives in new york and he says that the rats are really big and that sounds scary <laughs> it sounds terrifying Next victim. Who's it gonna be? Celia! They're bringing out all of my- all of my favorite villagers for this- the stream. How could I not do Celia's? She's so cute. I haven't seen her in game in so long. <laughs> if I see a random rat, I'm screaming. <laughs> Honestly, same. A refined reading residence. Cute. Of course that's what she would want. Okay, y'all. Cleo's back. Cleo's back enjoying the beach. Oh, you had pet rats. I've seen some people with pet rats like online and they always look so freaking cute. Let's go. <laughs> I love Celia. <laughs> the thumbnail for this live stream also, like, I had so much fun making that. <sighs> Celia, I don't even want to leave you. Come back to my island. Why would she actually be so cute on a spring court island? Maybe I should kick out Cat. <laughs> Maybe I should kick out Cat and try to get Celia. Cause she's just so adorable. She like matches the spring quarter like color scheme too. Celia, I'm so sorry to leave you with not a great vacation home, but we got things to do. Oh, she's so adorable. <laughs> oh. She looks so appreciative, even though it's so not good. It's not even functional. Like, it's just, it looks so bad. She's like, hmm. she, she looks kind of disappointed. <laughs> yeah, maybe I should kick out Kat for Celia. It's been too long since Celia was on one of my islands. 
It's been too long. She's so adorable. Plus, if I kicked her out, I wouldn't keep time traveling to Kat's birthday. Every live stream. Take a well-deserved break. Okay, go say hi to Nico. Yeah, Valencia, that's what I'm thinking. Like, I think her colors would be so perfect. And she would look so cute. Okay, why? Oh, is he not? Is he upstairs? I'm trying to speed run this, y'all. Thank you, Jake. I appreciate it. I'm trying to speed run this, y'all. I don't have time for breaks. Okay, what is he gonna teach me? Okay. So I just taught him all of the DIY recipes that I know? Okay. Okay. Thank you, Valencia. I appreciate the uh, motivational comments. <laughs> the hype comments. Thank you. Okay, can we go back to work now? Um, what are we even talking about? Oh, okay. So we can just use like the DIY items that we've unlocked like in our vacation homes now. That's cute. I'm ready to work. Let's get back to it. Let's find our next victim. Our next victim. Oh, I saw this villager on, on a dream address that I went to. And I was wondering who it was. His name is Kurt. He's so cute. Hello, Sly. Welcome in. I hope all is well with you, too. Thank you so much. We're just speedrunning some Happy Home Paradise today. As always, Cleo's throwing her party out on the beach. She's, like, recruiting more people each time. <laughs> She's recruiting more villagers every time. A painter's retreat. See, some of these are actually, like, so cute. Some of these are actually so cute. I feel like a painter's retreat would go on on this on this little plot. Did he just call me Fuzzball? That's so adorable. Yeah, Cleo's spilling the tea. Like she's starting like a gossip party. I don't know. Maybe she's starting like a book club or something on the beach. That would be so cute. <laughs> I love that he says fuzzball. That's so adorable. Oh, this is wow. This is like a really intense uh, little plot of land. It's pretty cool. Cleo is cute. I mean, I'm gonna, I'm definitely gonna remember her name now after this stream. Okay, here you go. This is really sad of a room to come to to get inspiration for your paintings, Kurt. I'm I'm very sorry, Kurt. But it's just it's gonna have to work. Maybe it'll help him clear his mind because there's not a lot of distractions going on around him. And then he can just paint whatever his heart desires. <laughs> this is so sad. He, oh no, he looks disappointed. <laughs> They always look like 
either super enthusiastic or super disappointed. I think it's also just his, like, eyebrows. Does he have, like, a bandage on his forehead? It's, it's so cute. Yeah, he can use the walls as a canvas. Exactly. It's his job to make this place look good, not mine. <laughs> How much pokey did we earn? Um, let's let's go. We're still working. What's happening? He was, he was here. It's Poppy! <laughs> Poppy's so adorable! What does he want? He better not say that he wants me to come redo his home. Let me see what he says. So, um, I really want someone I can share my vacation house with. I feel like my vacation house would be even funner that way. So he wants a roommate. He wants a roommate. And they were roommates. This is cute. Leave it to me. I'll give you a cute roommate. <laughs> I will give you a cute roommate. I like how he comes to us to find a roommate. Like, go on Facebook Marketplace or something. <laughs> Is that, do you, can you even find roommates on there? Oh my... Y'all... Celia has taken over Cleo's beach party. Cleo's not out there anymore. But I see Celia and she's eating a little like kebab. Interesting. I feel like we're watching like the drama unfold before us. The gossip group evolves. <laughs> okay, so find a roommate for Poppy. Oh no, Poppy. I don't know if you're going to enjoy any of these roommates. <laughs> what about Hazel? <laughs> what about Hazel? Oh, <laughs> Hazel's- oh my gosh, okay. I guess they have to meet first. Okay. I feel like we're put setting them up on like a blind date or something. What is he saying? Or Hazel said, don't take this the wrong way, but you're a lot funnier than I expected you to be, Poppy. It seems the two of you are getting along really well. Why do I feel like this is like a dating show? Oh my, they're ready to be roommates. This is actually kind of cute. <laughs> this is cute. The match made in heaven. This is Tiger's matchmaking service. <laughs> oh my gosh, I forgot how cute Poppy's house looked. Wow. Hello, car. Welcome in. See, Hazel's the one villager that's gonna luck out in this stream because Hazel doesn't get like a non decorated house. She just gets to move in with Poppy, and Poppy has a cute house. So wait, what's different on the inside? Hello, Mina Bug. We've just been speed running. We've gone through a bunch of different homes. Wait, this one was so good. I totally forgot how cute this was. It's ready. <laughs> um, yeah, I think we can keep the name. Okay, let's see. I want to see this montage. Why are they so cute together? They're just like doing everything together now. This is so adorable. Wow. 
This is like Love is Blind. <gasps> Not Poppy finding the carrot cake that I left on his nice stand. This is so cute. Aww. I hope they have a happy marriage. <laughs> Adorable. Poppy and Hazel are together now. All right, see y'all later. Bye. <laughs> they were the perfect roommates. They were adorable. Interesting. Okay. We're gonna have a roommate matchmaking service now. That's pretty cute. That's a cool idea that they included. All right, on to the next. Let's let's do it. Let's see who's out there. Let's see. Maybe I should start getting rid of some of these villagers that I haven't done yet. I've been ignoring them this whole stream. Like these two. And this robot. Oh, but this one's so cute. I and he wants an ice cream shop. Like that's adorable. Hello Deshaun, how are you? Welcome in. Oh, look at his little toe beans! Toe beans spotted! Oh, y'all, Cleo is back again, running the gossip group again. She's got the potty lion with her Lionel, I think. Cute! <laughs> cute! A retro ice cream shop? Like, how? That's so cute. Let's do it, and let's put him on this this glacier again. I mean, it's a retro ice cream shop. Like, it makes sense, okay? <laughs> no, why is Cleo's gossip group, like, the best part of this stream? <laughs> the tea queen. No, you guys know what I need. I need an emo, like, you know, the sipping tea Kermit meme. I need that, but with Cleo. <laughs> That's what we need. Oh, that's so funny, Daisy. I'm pretty sure, yeah, Cleo was the one who wanted the the bathroom, too. All right, here you go. Here's your retro ice cream store. It looks abandoned, but, you know, it's just that's the retro vibes, right? I love the little dancey dance they do before the montage. It's so adorable. My cow is meowing at me. Cute. All right, I should go now. See you later, Ike. Thanks for trusting me. <laughs> Thanks for trusting me with your vacation home. I tried so hard on it. I hope you love it. Thank you for the payment, Lottie. I appreciate it. Okay, why do you keep forcing me to take a break? I'm trying to speed run this. I don't- oh, accidentally deletes game. <laughs> Rage quits. Okay, I took a stroll. Now let me work. Please. A stroll outside? Okay, fine. 
I guess we have to go speak to Wardell. Yeah, we, we have to go find him on the beach. All right, where is he? <gasps> Tipper, hello. I forgot how like cute it is over here. Oh, wait a minute. Look at them. They're kind of looking cute together. Cleo, so cute. There's a spot open just for me. Oh, this is kind of cute. This is cute. This is wholesome. This is wholesome. The sound of birdsong can connect us to nature just by listening. This is wholesome. Oh man, I took the screenshot like right when he jumped off. <laughs> He's so cute. <laughs> I forgot about this that you can add sounds to the the houses. I just I have to take a picture of Cleo. She is just so unbothered and I I love her. <laughs> I love her so much. Yeah, this is my first time like playing through the whole thing. Hello, welcome in. I'm doing good, thank you. How are you? All right, now can I go back to work, please? I'm ready to work. Let's go. Let's do it. I wanted to... Oh, look at Celia back there. So cute. Um, I wanted to do Tipper next because she's adorable. Oh my gosh. Of course she wants a ranch. A bottle of ranch. <laughs> I'm just joking. <laughs> but really... A ranch for the cow? <laughs> Tipper's ranch. Cute. Oh, what is Kurt doing back there? Dancing? Hazel's back there. Where's Cleo, though? Hello, Eduardo. How are you? Welcome, welcome. Okay, I guess this can be her ranch. Let's go. Come on, Tipper. Has anyone been keeping track? I don't know how many how many homes I've done now. No, but I'm seriously still craving some some pizza also like look this this background actually has some decorations it's pretty interesting pretty interesting i'm still craving pizza though like i might actually want pizza after this which vill which villager did you kick out eduardo i'm curious i'm curious all right, Tipper, here you go. Tipper is adorable. I really like her. I think I had her on an island before. I can't remember. Uh, Aurora is cute, though. But I don't blame you for kicking her out. See you later, bread fan. Thanks for hanging out with us today. I hope you have a great rest of your week. It's getting kind of hot in here. I think I'm going to take off my little cardigan. 
This is like my iconic desk cardigan that I wear every single day and I just leave it at my desk. <laughs> yeah, Jake, you can always gift some memberships. I'm sure that the chat would greatly appreciate it, and so would I. Oh, you got Tipper in your campsite? That's always- it's so lucky when you get- when you get a villager in your campsite that you actually want to move onto your island. There's like so many villagers in this game too, so... You must be really lucky. Especially if you were like looking for her specifically. Okay, why? Why does it make me change out of my work outfit? I, I want to... I want to keep working. All right, let's go. Let's go. Who's our victim? Who is this? Drift? He's kind of cute. He's kind of cute. The f oh, oh, Cleo's moved in closer. She's literally like, all right, I'm, I'm coming in for the gossip. Like, she's here to, to collect the tea. She is here to collect the tea. Oh, she got caught. She got busted. She's like, oh, shoot, I'm on camera. I gotta go. <laughs> she's wild for that. She was eavesdropping for sure. She's got to get all the good gossip. <laughs> she got caught in 4K. That is so funny. That is just so funny. She's cracking me up this stream. I'll oh, see you later, Michelle. Have a great rest of your day. Thanks for coming and thanks for your help today. Especially with all the, the tips and tricks and the villager names. We'll, we'll chat later. Oh, don't forget to send me the TikTok that you saw on Happy Home Paradise. Because I want to see that. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Drift is cute. He has like a really unique pattern and coloring. I like it. I love it. Oh my gosh, there's a huge bird that just flew right by my window and it scared me. The fear. My cat's even like, what was that? All right, Drift, here is your home. It's ready. It is ready. These montages are just so sad. These montages are just so sad. It doesn't even have a well in here. I mean, I guess wells don't go inside. <laughs> okay, I need to count how many houses we've done so far. All I know is that we've done more than 10. It would be- it would go by so much faster if there wasn't so much, like, dialogue in between each one. <gasps> Thank you so much, Jake, for gifting a membership! Thank you so much, bread fan! Let's go! Welcome! I'm not sure what my alerts are doing. The alerts are just, like, not behaving. <laughs> yeah, let's have a dance party. Let me just get out of this dialogue. Let's get out of this dialogue. Thank you so much, Jake, for gifting a membership. Breadfan, now you can use all of the cute custom emotes in chat. And you'll have a cute little butterfly wing next to your name. All right, let's go. It's time for a dance party. Let's go. Congrats, bread fan, for becoming a member. And if you haven't, if you weren't here during the last stream, 
We're doing something new for all of our members. I'm gonna pick out a sticker for you and put it on the stream water bottle. If you were a member before we started doing this, whenever you get your milestone chat, I will, I will do one. I'm just gonna pick one random for you, Breadfan. And I, yeah, Breadfan said they had to go, but hopefully they'll rewatch. <laughs> Tom looks sad at work. <laughs> Why is he sad at work? He's working that office job. I kind of love it though. I kind of love it though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is an honor of bread fan. Okay, I need to get the sticker. I like bite my nails, which is embarrassing, but it makes it hard to open the sticker. So I'm I'm focused. I'm focused. All right, let's put it on. I'm gonna put it on the bottom. Okay. <laughs> Why is it actually really cute? I love it. I love it. Thank you so much, Jake, for gifting a membership. Now we have another sticker on the stream water bottle. And by the way, hydration check. Hydration check. Okay, let's get back to work. <laughs> let's get back to work. Time for our next victim. Let's see, can I see how many houses I've done? Let's see. So... Okay. So I think we've almost done about 20. Maybe a little bit less. I mean, it did remind us when we got to 10 houses. So maybe when we get to 20, it'll like tell us again. Maybe we can have another pizza party. Okay, let's pick our next victim. Let's do this, let's do this guy, Lopez. He's pretty cute. Leave it to me. Leave it to me, Lopez. Thank you, Valencia. Thank you so much. <laughs> I didn't even read what he wanted. That's how bad this is getting. I'm not even reading it. I don't see I don't see uh Cleo back in the back this time. She got busted last time, so now she's just like embarrassed. She's been caught. <laughs> she's the island gossip. Okay, Lopez. It's time to get the most underwhelming vacation home that, that you could get. I'm very sorry for it. <laughs> Let's go. My piece of the big city. And I put him I put him in like the forest. So much for the big city, I guess. Sorry about that, Lopez. There you go. Oh. But that's some nice nice music. It's ready for you. Aria and Coraline, those are really cute cat names. My cats are Bandit, Henry, Rusty, and Tundra. Bandit was looking at me when I said that. <laughs> so cute. He's sitting on the window. Um, I need I need to head back. See you later, Lopez. Enjoy your very empty, sad vacation home. Okay, what's gonna happen now? Wow, we're just like racking in the pokey. 
Yay, so we've done 20 homes. That means that we're two thirds of the way there. We only have 10, 10 more homes to get through, I think. And then we'll be done. So I think that we're not even gonna go over two hours. I'm surprised. Oh no, we're having the party in the in the sad restaurant. Why couldn't we have it upstairs like last time? This is so sad. <laughs> oh yeah, 10 out of 10. Definitely like a five-star high-end restaurant we got going on here. This place has been getting great reviews. <laughs> I can totally see why. It's it's so nice. <laughs> Best decoration I've seen ever. Thank you, Daisy. Thank you. A music festival? Should I be reading this? I've been trying to think of things that would make our clients happy and joyful when they leave here and go back to their daily lives. I want them to take happy memories with them. So I started thinking about what we could do to make that happen. An event on the scale I'm thinking of will require more help from the entire team. Of course I'm in. I'm always in for a dance party. Oh, my zodiac sign, I'm a Sagittarius. My birthday is December 19th. Okay, so we just need 10 more homes. Then we can have like a dance, a wholesome dance party. Oh, no way, you're a Sagittarius too? Nice. Ah, oh, Jake, you're up so late. Thanks for being here though. I completely understand. I don't know how you even stay up that late. Like, well, okay, last night I was watching Attack on Titan and I was staying up way too late. But I still only stayed up till like 11.15 or like 11.30 maybe. And that was like really late for me. Usually I go to sleep way sooner than that. Oh, that makes sense. That makes sense. I feel like all college students just are always pulling all-nighters and staying up late. And their sleep schedules are, are always chaotic. When my husband was still in, in college, our sleep schedules were so chaos. Oh, look at this cute frog, Jeremiah. I love him. Let's definitely do his house. I just, I love the frogs. They're just so friend-shaped. Okay, Cleo is back out. Cleo is back out. She's gossiping behind this building so we can't see her. Celia's here too, looking cute. Hello, Lori. Welcome in. How's it going? Daisy. You need to get your rest. I mean, as long as you're getting your rest. I mean, I guess it doesn't matter what time, right? <laughs> yeah, what are you studying, Jake, if you don't mind telling us? All right. Time for another vacation home. We're going to put max amount of effort into. House of Nap. That's actually super cool. That sounds cozy and cute. I would love to take a nap. I actually took a nap earlier today. But it was only for like one hour. Oh, English and creative writing. That sounds super cool. I love writing. Especially creative writing. Are you guys like night owls? It, okay, everybody let me know in the chat if you're a night owl or if you're an early bird. I'm gonna start, I'm gonna do a poll. Because I'm curious. And polls are fun. Vote in the poll. It's it's for fun. 
<laughs> I'm not I'm not collecting data on you. <laughs> okay, let's go. I'm I'm definitely an early bird. I like to wake up super early. I used to be a night owl, but I've changed. I have changed. You're a night owl for studying and live streams? Mina Bug, that's so late to go to bed. Okay, so like, it seems like we're half and half. We're half night owls, half early birds. I can see that. Oh no, Nico's here. Oh my gosh, I remember having to carry around a binder. But I had like a big binder that could fit like a bunch of stuff inside of it. It was kind of like a backpack, but a binder. I don't know if you guys remember those. I feel like they're not popular anymore. It was like it had a strap and it went across. Wait, what's happening? Is Lottie sick or something? What's going on? <laughs> Nico looks so cute. Eugene? What is happening? <laughs> Me just like clueless. I'm like not reading any of of the dialogue. A place to tell my story. This this villager kind of looks like Drake Bell. <laughs> Look, Cleo's out there leading her gossip train. <laughs> she just ate something from the low budget restaurant. She did. I knew it. I knew we should not have had our pizza party at, at the restaurant that I made. We should have just had it upstairs. All right, let's go. I love Nico filling in for Lottie. It's kind of cute. <laughs> He's kind of cute when he does it. All right. Let's go. I'm just going to pop open all the boxes and then head out. There we go, there we go, and there we go. And by the way, if you're enjoying the stream, be sure to leave a like. I would much appreciate it. And if you're not subscribed, you should do that too. Okay, Eugene, it's ready for you. Every time I hear the name Eugene, though, I think about um, Eugene from The Walking Dead. But I haven't seen that show in so long. Hello, kitty. Kitty. He's like, who? My name is not Kitty. It's Band-Aid, by the way. He wants my attention. He always starts getting, like, a little antsy towards the last half of my streams because he's like, okay, you've been, you've been giving them attention too long. It's my turn. He also probably just wants food, even though it's not even time for him to eat. Yay, Lottie's better. All this dialogue, I'm just... I cannot be bothered to read it. <laughs> Panda is hungry now, honestly. It's relatable. 
Ever since we had the pizza party for 10 houses in this game, I've been just thinking about pizza. Cute. Let's keep working. Same Daisy. A same. All right. Who's our next victim in this chaotic speed run? Let's choose. Oh, it's Bam. We have to do Bam. Oh, see you later, Jake. Thanks so much for hanging out, and thanks so much again for gifting a membership. We appreciate you. Bye. All right, let's do it. Cleo's still back there leading the gossip group. Oh, and we also have this little guy, Jeremiah, out there, too. It's pretty cute. I love how the villagers are in the background. Let's let's do some over here in this like desert area. I haven't even done anything back there. I mean, I guess I could give one of the villagers a two level home, but I just keep doing the one level home because it, I don't know, it just seems easier. <laughs> this is my new base. I love that. My cooking life. Let's see what items he needs in here. A bathroom? This is like a bathroom item. And then this is what? Like a rice cooker? That's super random. <laughs> super, super random. Alright, let's just skip through this. Oh no, you need an island name? I'm not good at coming up with island names. Everybody give your best city core island names to the chat to help Daisy. I would say just pick like a popular city that you maybe are taking inspiration from, but also that might be a little bit basic. Like you could probably come up with something cool and original, but... I don't know. There's so many cities and towns in this world. I feel like no matter what you choose, it's possible that it's already a city name. Oh my gosh, it's Mitzi! How can we say no to Mitzi? She's so cute! I, I feel like I haven't seen her in-game in, in such a long time. And, and look... Cleo's still back here. She's recruited more people. She's got Celia in on the gossip now. Celia used to be not into it, but now she, she's in. She's in on the gossip group. Hello, Saffron. Welcome in. How are you? I'll see you later, V. Thanks for lurking. Okay, one second. I gotta kick my cat out. <laughs> he's being- he's just- he keeps coming under my desk and trying to chew on my cords as a way to harass me, to try to convince me to feed him. <laughs> I can't- I just- I had to close him out. Unfortunately, Mitzi kind of does give honeydew vibes. Like, why would she actually be so cute on my island? Why would she actually be so cute? 
Whoa, she's got a huge box out here. What is this? Oh, it's this little thing. Cute. Ooh, yeah, Timmy, that's a great idea. Like a fictional city from a game or a movie that you maybe really like. That's what I did for my island Salt Cliff. It was based off of an island um, in Game of Thrones. The name, at least. Oh, do you like Megan Trainer? I know, I know, like a few of Megan Trainer's songs, but I'm, I, I mean, I really like her, but I'm not like the hugest, biggest fan of her. I've seen her on TikTok sometimes. Has she released music lately? I feel like I haven't heard one of her songs in like a really long time. Have you guys seen all the JoJo Seaball stuff? <laughs> it's like haunting me every single day. Like, I can't get that song out of my head. In a bad way. <laughs> okay, we have to do a hospital s facility now. <laughs> Kim, you too. <laughs> Well, now, like, the original artist who sang um, that song, like, released it, I think. <laughs> yeah, it's actually killing you. Same. Same, same. Let's make this hospital green. Kind of like watermelon vibes. Cute. Cute. But yeah, I I've seen so many memes of JoJo Siwa and it's like I'm I'm just I'm done with it. <laughs> I'm done with it. I feel like she's just trolling everyone. Okay, we already have a counter and now we just need four chairs. Cool, just make the- it kind of looks like a waiting room, right? And then we'll go back here and see what we need. Ooh, the exam room. It's kind of creepy. All we need is the patient's chair. I'll give them the froggy chair. Let me turn it around, too. There we go. Perfect. That was the most effort I've put into any of the of the houses so far. Oh wait, no. Why is this actually the perfect pair for the doctor and the receptionist? Like, of course Cleo, the gossip girl, would be the receptionist. It makes it makes so much sense. <laughs> Okay, let's just skip through this. Aw, oh, Mitzi and Tipper are here at the doctor's office. Cute. I guess it's a hospital, so I guess it's like an emergency room. Oh my gosh, Celia's getting examined. We should not be in here. This is like a HIPAA violation. Oh wait, yeah, we do need to take a photo. We need we need to take the photo. <laughs> we should not have been in there. Oh, this is cute. Yeah, Lottie got sick and she was like she realized that she had to leave the island to get some healthcare, so she's like, okay, now we need to open a hospital. Cute. It's perfect. Yeah, maybe I should come back and remodel the buildings, because the buildings are actually cute. Like, the facilities, 
I feel like they're really fun to design. I really like decorating the school. All right, here's some more pokey. Amazing. Let's keep working. Let's keep working. Actually, how many houses have I decorated now? Let's see. Let us see. Okay. So I think we're like really close. We are very close. I think we only need to do like six more. Oh, Peoria is such a throwback. <gasps> Nan! So cute! I was like saying that we needed to decorate these other villagers' vacation homes because they've been here since the very beginning of the stream. But then every time that a new villager shows up, it's like a really cute villager, so then I can't say no to them. A luxury hotel? That sounds fancy. That sounds really fancy. Let's do it over... Ooh, let's do it where these, like, pillars are. I love Nan, too. She's so underrated. And she's so adorable. Thank you, Eduardo. I love ice cream. <laughs> I love ice cream so much. This is the stream that I'm just like craving all these food items now. Like, I want ice cream. I want pizza. I even want carrot cake. Hi, Madeline. Good to see you. Welcome in. Welcome, welcome. We're just we're making our way through the speed run, okay? Honestly, it takes longer than I would have anticipated. Ooh, cheesecake does sound so good. I love cheesecake. I love like classic cheesecake with just like some strawberries. So tasty. I also love like Oreo cheesecake. Gotta love the classic Oreo. Oh, thank you, Valencia. I love Sedona. Honestly, I think Sedona is one of my absolute favorite islands I've done too. Okay, she's gonna make me do walk around the island again. Oreo cheesecake is so good. Honestly, like, just Oreo anything is really good. I love Oreos. Okay, I guess let's try to go this way. I don't know who we're looking for. Oh, Buttonwoods is really cute. I like that name. Do we need to talk to Wardell again? I thought we've already done this. I thought we already have done this. Bread fan, welcome back! Jake left, but Jake gifted a membership and you got it. And we picked out a sticker for the water bottle for you. And it's this little Tom Nook at work sticker. <laughs> so congrats! I'm so glad that you came back. Okay, so why did we- I thought we already knew how to do the soundscapes. Is that what we were supposed to be talking to, to him about? Is that what we were supposed to do? Wait, <laughs> 
Interesting. Interesting. Oh, he gave me more soundscapes. Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, bird fan. Now you can use the the membership emotes. Including the baby Tom Nook, which is my favorite. I'm gonna spam baby Tom to the chat. <laughs> it's my absolute favorite. And we threw a dance party for you. Okay, let's just do this villager ace. Let's just do his little house. <laughs> yeah, the baby Tom. All the hype. Goldie is such a cute villager. I can see why she would be your dreamy. Yay! I love seeing all the members' emotes. Like, they're so cute. Especially the maple ones. And the baby. Okay, Ace. Here's your fishing hole. Oh, this is perfect for like a fishing hole. It's like surrounded by water. I didn't even know. That was not calculated. All right, let's open this up. It's ready. Oh, uh, Maple's your dreamy for your island. That's amazing. Maple's, Maple's the best. If I had to keep only one of my islands, I don't know. That would be so hard to choose. I feel like... Ooh, I don't know. I feel like I just want to say Honeydew because it's the one I'm working on now, so I'm, like, attached to it. <laughs> but also, like, Salt Cliff, my original island that I built on YouTube. <laughs> yes, birds do eat fish. I love the chaos emote. The maple chaos. Alright. A Domino's ad interrupted my stream. See, this is my sign. I need pizza. <laughs> I need pizza. All of the signs are telling me today that we that we need to have pizza for dinner. <laughs> I'll see you later, Nat. Thanks for hanging out with us today. Have a great rest of your week. Hopefully, we'll see you on Thursday. We're going to be building a butterfly garden on Thursday, by the way, and I'm super excited because I think it's going to turn out really cute. <gasps> Portia, my queen! The OG Salt Cliff Queen! So cute! They're giving us the best villagers in Happy Home Paradise right now. The best villagers. Alright, let's put you over here, Portia. Her outfit's so classy. You've never seen her before? I love Portia. She is such an underrated villager. And I think she's so adorable. She's classy. Look at her, she's so cute. All right. Let's do, let's do this, let's do the, the thing. Jake, thank you so much for gifting another membership. 
Thank you so much! A dance party for Madeline! Madeline, you got the gifted membership! Congrats! And welcome! <laughs> welcome! Your dance party's in the middle of the montage! <laughs> Congrats! All the hype in the chat! All of the hype in the chat! Let's pick a sticker for you, Madeline, for the water bottle. Um, Jake, by the way, you were supposed to be going to bed. <laughs> but thank you! Okay, I'm just gonna pick a random one. It's Isabel! This one's cute! This one's so cute! Now let me put it on the water bottle. Bear with me as I try to get the sticker off the paper. I love the maple chaos emote. I'm so glad that more of you can use it now. Okay, I've got the sticker. Now I need to find a spot for her. It's Isabel. She can go right next to Daisy Mae. Cute! Thank you so much again, Jake! And congrats, Madeline! And also, hydration check. Did you guys hear that? <laughs> I don't know what that sound was. Bread fan, your sticker was this one. <laughs> your sticker was this one. It's Tom Nook sitting at an office desk. It's very cute. It's very cute. <laughs> Thank you so much, Jake. <laughs> you didn't see me by. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank you. Tom Nook is here. We summoned him. We summoned him with all the baby Tom Nook emojis. Yeah, I, I haven't been working too hard, Tom. Oh, honeydew does depend on me. Are we getting like more furniture unlocked? Super cute. Oh my gosh, all the hype emotes. I always forget about the Julian hype emoji. I love that emoji. <laughs> Okay, see you later, Tom. No worries. I love it when you guys spam the member emotes. Like, they're so cute. That's what they're there for. Please spam them all the time. <laughs> I love to see them. I love to see them. Um, let's keep working. Let's keep going. Eduardo, that's like the worst. When your switch dies, it's so sad. So, everyone put an F in the chat for Eduardo's switch. Rip. <laughs> Rip Eduardo's switch. Okay, who is our next victim? Let's do... <gasps> Plucky! A Sedona OG. Let's do it. Let's do it. She's so cute. I forgot how cute she was. <laughs> right. I, we shouldn't have too many more homes to go. I don't know if this is our last one. I don't know if this is the 30th one. I don't think so. Alright. Okay, Plucky, let's just open up all of your little... 
all your little boxes and call it a day. I already gave Plucky a really cute house back on Sedona Island, so she can't say anything about this, okay? She can't say anything about it. There's just a single ukulele in her house. <laughs> oh no. This montage is gonna be cute. Plucky was your starter villager? I love that. I love that. A home for the hula life. See, it needed to be empty so they had room to practice the hula dance. <laughs> so cute. I miss Plucky. I love the chicken villagers. They're like one of my favorite species. Okay, we're back. Let's collect that bag. I'll work a little bit longer. Okay, we gotta do a cafe now. We gotta do a cafe. Louis and Canberra. My starters were Cat and Rod. Yeah, the cats are just like so cute in this game. I don't blame you for those being your favorite. Let's make this yellow. I'm just doing like really bright and colorful buildings so they look like beachy. So cute. So cute. All right. Let's see what we need. We just need a cash register and two more chairs and we're done. Welcome to the saddest cafe ever. So cute. Yeah, Lopez and Gonzo can work here. Amazing, amazing, amazing. And we're done. What? Rosie? Did we decorate a house for Rosie? If so, I completely forgot. Renee and Antonio, I like those villagers. Those sound actually really cute. I can't remember exactly which one is Renee. I know she's a horse. Oh, Renee the Rhino. Not Renee. Oh, I need to, I need to do this. Yeah, never mind. I take it back about what I said. I mean, Antonio is still cute though. I don't know about Renee the Rhino though. All right, let's do our celebratory photo. At least you have Antonio and not any of the other anteaters. I feel like Antonio is the only cute one. All right. Cute. It's perfect. Let's go. How many houses do we have left? Let's see. Let's see how many. Okay, so I think that we only need two more. If my math is correct. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> I think we only need two more.
Okay, let's just... Well, let's see who else is here. Oh, this is cute. This is new. Oh, is it because it's for the cafe? That's cute. This villager? Oh my gosh. Not the baby. Oh my god. And their eyes are in sync. Like, really? That is interesting. Okay, let's do one of these villagers that's been here since the very beginning. We can do Bertha. We can do Bertha. Let's do it. A bungalow of cozy baskets. <laughs> that's very specific. Very strange request, but let's do it. I'll put you over here. Yeah, I same, Daisy. Same. Like, I love and hate the kangaroo villagers, too. Like, they're so funny, and, like, I love that they're in the game, but I would never invite one to my island. And if they were on my island, I'd kick them off immediately. <laughs> as soon as possible. Okay, Bertha. Okay, Bertha, let's go. Let's get your little house set up with your three baskets. Your three <laughs> different kinds of baskets. I love Meringue and Azalea too. They're super cute. Matilda? I don't remember which one that one is. I'm gonna look it up. I just looked up Matilda like with no context. Like I did not put Animal Crossing, so it just pulled up the Matilda movie. Uh, Matilda's cute. Better than most. I just, I really don't know about the little, the little babies in their pouch. It's just a little strange. And they don't have names, do they? Like, because it's just Matilda. Like, do we ever know her child's name? I'll see you later, bread fan. Congrats again on becoming a member. Okay, wait, what's happening? I didn't read anything again. Okay. I think that this might be the last house that we need to decorate. I could be completely wrong, but I think that this is it. Nope, the babies don't have names. The kangaroos always have kids' toys in their home for them, which is cute. That is cute. It's kind of sad that they don't have names, though. Are these lamps new? I don't remember those being there. No, not cephalobot. Wait, what is all this? They added, like, lights and stuff all around? Let's do this one. Marlo? Was Marlo one of the new villagers that got added with the 2.0 update, or am I just completely making that up? Because why do I feel like he's new? Oh, Nico is setting up, like, for the party? Alright, let's put him here. A movie star mansion. Interesting. Let's give you a one level home. I guess Sherb looks cute in a dress. Let's go. Yeah, so Marlo is a 2.0 villager. What a random villager to add. I mean, he's cool, I guess, but... 
I feel like he's not on the same level as Shino or Sasha. Alright. Here we go. I think this is our 30th one, so... What an accomplishment. What an accomplishment. Yeah, Marlo's expressions are pretty funny. He kind of reminds me of Raymond. He kind of reminds me of Raymond. I like his glasses. All right, Marlo, see you later. Enjoy your sad, scarce office. He said he wanted a mansion, but I gave him a really small room <laughs> with hardly anything in it. We almost have 500,000 pokey, like, that's pretty good. <gasps> this last job was the 30th vacation home that you've been in charge of. Would you rather, wait, what does this say? Would you rather go to the restaurant or the cafe? <laughs> the restaurant and the cafe are horrible. I guess we'll do the restaurant. They're so bad. They're not decorated. They're not decorated. Okay, let's just see. Oh no. Oh no. Cheers, everyone. <laughs> Cute. Why does Lottie always get the fancy beverage? Like, that's the beverage that I want. That's the one that I want. Modest placebo, what's up? Happy Tuesday. It does look like a prison in here. I'm so excited. I've never seen any of this before, by the way. <laughs> yeah, this looks so much like a prison. Uh, I mean, best restaurant ever. <laughs> okay, what's happening? Cute! I love the music. Oh, I might need to do the store before the celebration. Alrighty. Alrighty. Oh, it's the very last thing that we need to do? Okay. Well, let's go. Should be super easy. It should be super easy. Let's do it then. The apparel shop. Let's make it colorful. Cute. Cute. Now the inside, it's, it's not going to be cute. I'm warning you now. It's not going to be cute. Oh my gosh, it's so creepy in here. Oh wow, can we like actually come in here and buy um, clothing after it's like ready? That's pretty cool. Okay, and then let's go ahead and add... Okay. My shoe just fell off. <laughs> All right. What kind of shows or, or clothes are we thinking? Um, cute. Cute clothes. Even though it's kind of a creepy, um, a creepy store. Um, who should be in charge? Like, who looks like they would run, like, a scammy t-shirt business? I think Eugene. Oh, yeah. Definitely. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely Eugene. Okay. Now can we do the celebration? Oh 
no. <laughs> oh no, let's let's leave them to that. <laughs> That's my best work yet. Yeah, exactly. It's my best design work. Oh, you can buy the clothes? That's so cute. Okay, let's do our celebratory photo. Eugene totally looks like he would have a scammy t-shirt business. Look at him. Like he, yeah, he was, he was perfect for this job. <laughs> Cute. I'm so happy. Oh, I love Stella. And I love Aurora, but Goldie and Toby are pretty cute, so I don't blame you for kicking them out. It's perfect! Let's, let's do it! Let's go! Finally, we've, we've really done the whole speed run today. Oh, back at the pizza party! Oh, I want pizza so bad. Okay. I think we're going to the event. Oh my gosh, everyone's here. It's so cute. Look at Celia. Oh, what's going to happen? Stop. This is so cute. It's KK. Whoa. Stop. I've never seen this before. This is epic. Is this Coachella? It is Coachella. Stop. Oh my gosh. This is sick. <laughs> I feel like I'm literally at like a Fortnite concert. Stop the bubbles. We can add confetti. It's so cute. Oh my stop. Wow. I'm a famous designer. <laughs> This is so cute! <laughs> oh, it's all the houses I've decorated! They started out so cute. And then, and then they got so bad. This is so wholesome! We did it, you guys! The speedrun was successful. <laughs> oh, I loved that one. So cute. I love it. <laughs> I love it so much. This is so wholesome. I love the dancing. Like, that was such a good idea. <laughs> Mitzi's Mountaintop Eatery, and it's literally just a barrel. <laughs> this song does slap. <laughs> no, these are so bad. Not all of the just empty homes that have all the same wallpaper and flooring. How embarrassing. But imagine if, like, they were all actually super cute. Th this would be even more epic. I love this. Look at Celia. I love her little hat. Oh my god. All the villagers are so cute doing their little dances. <laughs> Not the apparel store. <laughs> How cute. I love this. Uh, 
Why is this wholesome? I gotta take screenshots. I've literally never seen this. I never watched it. Wow. I can't believe I've avoided that spoiler for so long. And now I finally know what happens at the end of Happy Home Paradise. Amazing! Of course, Nico has no idea who KK is. Like, of course, he would be the one who had no idea. <laughs> so cute and fun. I'm so glad that we did the speed run, y'all. I did not have the patience to do all that. And we're still going to be streaming on Tuesdays. I don't know. I might move it to Wednesdays or um, maybe Monday or something, but I don't know. We'll see. We're still going to be doing another stream, though. We're not going to cancel our third our third weekly stream. Yay! And I got all the new reactions. Amazing. We got all of the dancing reactions. I've never like gotten these before. That's so cute. Oh my gosh. Well, thank you guys so much for joining our last final Tuesday Happy Home Paradise stream. Next Tuesday, we'll just be doing some regular decorating on our island of Honeydew, which I'm gonna head back to Honeydew to say our goodbyes. I think, wait, do we get to see our flyover? Because I don't, I don't think I've like looked at my flyover yet. Please say yes. Yeah, now I can dance during the dance parties. I can actually dance during the member dance party. Oh man, we don't get to see our flyover. That's so lame. That is so lame. If, you're, if you haven't liked the stream yet, here's your final reminder. You should do it. It would help me out a ton. And I would appreciate it. That was so much fun. That was so, so much fun. And on the next stream, on Thursday, we're going to be building a butterfly garden on my island. And I think I'm going to build it back here. Like maybe up here on this cliff or something. I don't know. I don't know, but we'll see. Thank you so much, everyone, for hanging out today. I hope that you have a great rest of your day. And I will see you on Thursday with another Animal Crossing stream. Thank you to our members. Thank you to our mods. And as always, thank you to our viewers. You guys are awesome. And I will see you next time. Bye.